is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frankie de Jong plays with Franck Yannick Kessier in the centre of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. Lewandowski in the middle and a goal here to open the scoring from Robert Lewandowski well let's take another look now and it's a superb cross by Jordi Alba but should the keeper be beaten at his near post I don't think so he really needs to do better in those situations Ronald Araujo. Useful looking ball. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. take another look yeah he won't get an easier finish than that the defending was all over the place though chance to reduce the arrears and there is the goal well that changes the equation and they have the momentum now Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Defenders need to cover. Chance for Dembele. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. De Jong. Oh, he's done it! But hang on. Offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here, but the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. And that's it. The referee's whistle. Barcelona will be in the final. Yes, and thoroughly deserved, you have to say. Thought they controlled large parts of the game, they created enough chances, and if they can continue to replicate performances like this, they have to fancy their chances going forward. Well, it's understandable that we focus once again on Robert Lewandowski. How would you sum up his performance? Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable, and he inspires those around him. 